And welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine with Grandpa Noki. In all seriousness, welcome back, guys. Uh, last time, Grandpa Noki there just told us to jump into the waterfall, so let's be suicidal and do so. Whee! And for those who somehow missed the last episode, we are doing Ely Mal's Destet de <laughs> Yeah, that's exactly what we're doing. No, we're actually doing Ely Mal's Dentist. What an interesting name. Anyway, they're gonna want to slowly make our way down to the very scary-looking glowing eyes down there. Ooh, good thing I'm not like 10 years younger, otherwise I'd probably be scared of this level. Yeah, way back when, I used to be very scared of things. I couldn't play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time for the longest time. <laughs> anyway, though, as we float on down, eventually Ely there is gonna spin around and fly up to us. All we're going to want to do is spray at his teeth. Now, it's kind of easy to just hover above them and spray at them like this. I find it to be one of the easiest ways to do so. Sometimes it would be a good idea to, uh... Ugh! To try to find a good spot to float for a bit and just use your nozzle like this, such as that. There, like, yeah, you spraying nozzle. Anyway, though, we're going to want to grab some coins here before Mario drowns. Yeah, there's two over here we can grab rather easily. See how fast you can start going underneath here? It's ridiculous. Anyway, let's hover back over Ely here to... It's kind of funny how he has two faces. It's like a he-she. Well, it is a he-she, just looking at it. See, I find it much easier to do it this way because... I don't know, just trying to spray it becomes troublesome and it's hard to escape. So yeah, whenever he does that, just get the hell out of there. Grab some more coins if you need them and hop right back in. He's got the creepiest voice. Hell, I don't even think we have to float out sometimes. We could just keep trying to spray his teeth, but it can be kind of hard because it gets really hard to control when he's doing the whirlpool thing. Spin it around, you know, you spin me right round, baby, right round. God, he looks like a gigantic black dildo. Uh, I, I, turn around, Mario, if you would please. Now, every now and then, he's gonna try to close his mouth on you if you get too into it while he's doing the, uh, get, get too into it. He's gonna try to eat you up, and when, when he does a whirlpool thing and you get a certain spot in his mouth, he will uh, shut his mouth on you, and you will take damage, which can be a little bit troublesome, so just be careful of that. Okay, that's almost all of his teeth. Oh crap, I really need health. Okay, let's just float on over here. Alright, so ready, we all float on y'all. Oh, on. I don't really know the lyrics to that song, but it's really catchy. I like Modest Mouse, they're pretty cool. Okay, stop spinning around so I can spray your friggin' teeth. Oh, 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 whoa! Hey, yeah, like that, he almost got us that time. You got me! Diagonally. Pretty sneaky, sis. All right, dildo face. Let's get back into this. Eee! You know, it's hard to clean your mouth if you keep trying to eat me. <laughs> Golden tooth. Oh, there's only one more to clean, so hopefully I can get that done within five minutes. Since we're at 417 right at... Well, in the video time, we'll probably be a few seconds ahead of that, but whatever. Should be able to clean his last tooth up before I die or run out of oxygen. So let's try to do that. No, we're not going to be able to. Okay, gotta find some coins. Here's some up here. Uh, we're really cutting it close. 
Yeah, since there's only one tooth to clean, I will take the time now to grab some more coins. I don't want to risk dying when we're so close to completing this stage. When I first played through this game, this was I had a really hard time with this stage. It took me forever to beat it, just because of how friggin' annoying it is. But after I learned the underwater controls a bit more, it's not as hard. It's just annoying still. There we go. Remember to take, to take proper care of your teeth. Uh, thank you, Nintendo, for telling us to brush our teeth. This, it would just wouldn't be a Nintendo game without some kind of moral, would it? Some kind of life-changing lesson. Actually, Nintendo's not like that at all, really. <laughs> it's kind of funny that uh, Flood would say such a thing. I like when Ely leaves he, he, she leaves us a heart, <laughs> heart of coins. Anyway, let's just float on down. You just got the underwater shine. Shine! My voice is getting very tired. And I still have to record Mother 3 after this, damn it. <laughs> yeah, I've been neglecting that game quite a bit, so. <clears throat> Okie dokie. With that, let's hop back in here and see what we have to do next. Two Piant Simos Surf Swim. Hey, Two Piant Simos back. I'm gonna do his voice again. Oh, he's way up there. All we have to do is follow the string. Let's see what Grandpa no no Nokia has to say first. Now, hopefully, all of our people will return to home again. We all all to you. Thanks. And you say, do you know that guy? He's been waiting up there for you for quite a while. It's to you, our boys, okay, okay. What? Oh no, I almost made the bunny man. <laughs> okay. Whee! Oh, jeez, I just smashed my face in. Oh-ho, foolish man. I am Tupiot Simo. Yes, that is me. And now, I challenge you to a race to that flag. It is a race to the finish. The best time is 40 seconds. Are you at the ready? Then get set and go! Once again, this guy is pathetically easy if I just get a friggin' move on. Okay, I've probably just completely screwed this up. Alright, here we go. I like how the fish is trying to get me. I'm not even in the friggin' water, you dummy. This one is easy as pie. I took longer because I wasn't really aligned with myself, but seriously, it's possible to get here in like 10 seconds. Oh, huh. <laughs> you are quite speedy. You are like a fish. You may not be the slow clam chowder I took you on to buffer now. A babbity beep boo. May we what race again? Watch for me. Anyway. You just got the shine from Easy Me. Shine away. Okay. I think we are getting quite a bit done in this video. Yeah, Noki Bay has Noki Bay is a really cool place, but a lot of the shines are uh, a little too easy. The Shell Secret. Ooh, just what I wanted to do. I love the Secret of Missions, seriously. Ah, all we have to do is get ourselves into it. Hello, sir. Oh, sorry. Hey, Grandpa. Master Mario, you've become tied to our destiny. I'm afraid. A pathway to another world has opened above our fair land. Surely you will go there? Of course, you must go there. I apologize for involving you in all of this. Good luck. We'll cheer you on from here. Farewell. Now, at this point of the game, does anybody really remember that Princess Peach is even a part of it? <laughs> I wouldn't blame you if you forgot that she was even in this game, because seriously... I mean, the constant reminder of Mario 64 is that you were inside Princess Peach's castle. Here, you're everywhere. You're in the Noki's homeland, you're in Delfino Plaza, visiting all the attractions that the Piantos have to offer. 
Just like, uh, who cares about Princess Peach? We're seeing all the pretty sights without her. <laughs> I'm already having a vacation, Princess. How about you? You're off getting raped by Bowser. Anyway. Into the crazy green shell. Yeah, you know what, Shadow Mario? That's just getting old. I mean, it's not even a challenge anymore. This is definitely one of the more difficult secret shines. You start off in this, like, green tank thing, which I always found cool, because... Oh, never mind. I was gonna say, I think Mario just stays green the whole time he's inside of it, but... <laughs> Whee! Pretty sure a 1-up is in one of these nails. I'm not gonna take the time to get one, though, because I don't really need it. If I die once, then I'll grab it, try to find one, but... For now, I think we're pretty good on that. Gotta do some pretty friggin' tricky jumps to get a, get through this place, though. For starters, this is one of the hard ones. There we go. Because you have to be at the right angle, otherwise Mario will go the wrong direction. Do -do -do -do. This one is pretty friggin' tough, but it's as fun, it is my favorite. It is the best one of all. I like to climb and I like to jump, showing and flipping and doing my stuff. And I almost died from a simple mistake, but I will jump on the rope. Jumping on the ropes is so much fun, because they send you high. Spin jumps and flip jumps and sideways jumps. Are your friends and you'll die if you fall like that. <laughs> I don't want to die and restart again, so just keep going with it and almost kill myself by jumping off the edge. Hmm. Making my way back up again. Okay. Oh! Jump on up to the Mario! Swing! Oh, wait. <laughs> Uh, the song's a little too slow for the Mar do the Mario song to work. Ah. Okay. There we go. Now we have made it almost all the way to the freaking top. Uh, where do I want to jump here? There we go. Haha! -ha! Not quite how you're supposed to do it, but it worked. Do, 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 do. I remember the red coins in this place being pretty damn difficult to find, too. Do, 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 do. Holy crap, a friggin' thing. It's almost killed me because it was in the way. Damn it, Nappa, why didn't you dodge? You just got blown away. Shit! Oh! I was a little too close for comfort. Okay. Let's just calm down and concentrate for a bit. Ah, not like that. So calm down. Stop doing stupid things to almost get yourself killed. There's a shine sprite, thank god. You just got a stressful shine. Shine! Okay. And while we're at it, I'm just gonna go ahead and meet you guys right back here to do the red coins. So see you in a second. Welcome back! Okay, now that we're back in here, we can get the right coins. Hopefully on our first go, because we're running short on time here. Well, theoretically, I'm not, but I want to try to keep this all in 15 minute kind of stuff again. <clears throat> when it comes to posting longer than 15 minute videos, I'm generally trying to really avoid going over 20 minutes. Just because I think it's kind of inconvenient for anyone, like, I don't know, it's hard to, I know it's hard to watch long videos, because I've barely had time to watch everybody's videos lately, I mean, I haven't watched quite a few of my favorite people in a few days, just because I've been so busy and their videos have been too long. Though I probably can do some video watching while I'm editing and rendering stuff tonight, but anyway. Oh my god. Come on, we don't have that much time to waste, Mario. Get that jumping going. Oh, they do have that one on that pole, too. I don't really think about that. Okay, well, anyway, we've gotten it, at least. Forgot it was there, but... 
Now I know it's there. <laughs> now with Flood, it really makes some of these more difficult jumps a hell of a lot easier just in case you make a mistake and just use Flood to rearrange yourself, so that's all good. Okay, we're running short on time. Oh, don't use Flood when you don't need to either, because that's just stupid. <laughs> Those you'll end up dying like I did a few times because I used Flood when it wasn't necessary. And there's the last one! Okay, that wasn't so bad. Really kind of close on time there, but whatever. Okay, and with that, we'll get the shine and call the video. Whoa, camera. Calm down. Where did the shine go? It's over there. I will go get the shine. Do. You just got a freaking shine. Shine! Okay, with that, this has been Blue Bar Mama. Blue Bar Mama. I'm having a really hard time saying my own name. Have a great day!